Hi there guys, I'm Chris Bowden. Welcome back to the shop for episode 51 on Project Archie. Today we're going to be mounting our J4 drive pulley. You will need your XL 10 tooth 6 millimeter bore drive pulley, and you'll need a pair of M3 4 millimeter long set screws. I use the term set screw and grub screw interchangeably because so does industry, and just, just get used to that. You'll have two little pulleys left at this stage. You want the smaller one, just to be sure. So as you look at the motor shaft, you'll notice it's not round. It's actually, as we look down on it, you can see it's a D-shaped. It's got a flat spot. So on your pulley, you'll notice there's two different holes in it. You want to line one of those holes up to the flat spot. Before we put it on there, what I'm going to do is just prep it by putting the screws into it a little bit first. And we've done this in other steps. You know the rules, don't run it all the way down. You don't wanna be able to see any of the grub screw inside the pulley because if you do, it won't slide onto the shaft. But by doing it this way now, when you can hold on to everything, it might help reduce your chances of having to fight it when it's on a machine. Or worse yet, drop one of these tiny little screws on the floor because if you do, well, you better hope you have like a really hard, smooth floor that's absolutely clean and painted white and a metal detector. So I'm going to put this on and you can see I've got my two holes there and I've got my flat spot here. So I'm just going to bring that right up and over and drop it down. Now the pulley has to go on so that the shoulder here, I'll turn it so you can see it better. The pulley has to go on so that the shoulder is up against the motor, okay? It, it needs to be in that direction. If you put the pulley on backwards, you won't have enough of these to engage. So once it's in position, it is no imposition to just run these down. And then just give them a quarter turn. So run them down to finger tight plus a quarter turn, okay? Because you've got a very fine thread on a steel bolt in a piece of aluminum. And when they talk about space age aluminum, that's like one step away from dirt. Remember the space age was in the sixties, guys. It's been 60 years since then. So space age aluminum really isn't all it's cracked up to be. It's great to work with. for stuff like this. It's awesome. It's light. It's easy to machine but it's not ridiculously strong and it's very easy to strip out threads. So finger tight plus a quarter turn, that's all you get. And now it's on, it's good, it's mounted, it's wonderful. And when we come back, we're going to get a drive pulley on it. And before we come back, I'm gonna take a minute, loosen that and smack it down a little bit further because it's still not quite where I want it. So yeah, but you get the idea. You guys have fun, I'm Chris Bowden and as always, we'll see you next time. 